Hello everyone and welcome to Blender Tutorials. In this tutorial we will learn how to create a white background in images and animations created in Blender. This looks like a simple problem to solve, however it is not. Ok, here is the issue. Let us say that you modeled something, for example over here you can see a cube with different colors. And let's say that you want to generate an image or an animation such that the background is completely white. Let's first try to render this scene. We can do that by clicking over here and by clicking on Render Image. And this is what you will get. Then let's try to improve this by trying to change the background color. We can do that by clicking over here and then adjusting the color. So you can click over here and try to move this toolbar to here and you can see over here, this is the lightest color that you can get. OK, let's see the output now. Click on Render and click on Render Image. And this is the best we can get. For some reason, Blender does not provide completely white color. And let's try to solve this problem. However, before I start with explanation, I have to mention that it took me a significant amount of time, energy and planning to create this completely free video tutorial as well as almost 400 free video tutorials that you can find on my YouTube channel. Consequently, I kindly ask you to press the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks a lot! Ok, let's start from very beginning. Click on File, click on New and click on General. Ok, this is an empty Blender workspace. Let's add some material colors to our cube. Click on the cube, click over here, then click over here and click on the checker texture. And let's change the color by clicking over here. For example, let's choose yellow and over here let's choose red. However, you cannot see the colors over here. To see the colors, you can either press over here or press over here to see the rendered scene. Let us now adjust the lights and the camera such that we have a nice angle of view and such that we have a brighter scene. We can do that by first clicking on over here, that is by selecting light, and then let's increase the power, for example 5000 watts. Ok, then let's adjust the camera view. You can do that by clicking over here, then click over here or expand this menu, click on view, and over here click on camera to view and then zoom out and you can change the view of the camera if you want okay let's keep it like this then click here again and that's it let's try to render this scene click on render and click on render image okay this is the image in this tutorial i will teach you how to generate a png file of uh, this scene However, everything that I will explain in this video tutorial can be generalized to generating animations. Click over here and then select the output. I will call my image as image1 and click on accept. And select here the file format as PNG. This is very important since I don't want to generate animation, I just want to generate a single image. Then let's adjust the render properties. Click over here and select the render engine. Over here I will select cycles and let's adjust the cycles. For the purpose of this tutorial I will decrease the max sample since I want to quickly generate the image. For example I will place 1000 over here. However if you want to have a nice image I suggest that you keep the original settings. And over here we need to adjust a few things. First of all, click on Film and over here you need to click on Transparent. This is very important. This will generate a transparent image. However, you can verify what will happen now. Click on Render and click on Render Image. And you can see after some time, wait over here for the rendered process to finish, you can see that you're still having a dark background. Although it's transparent, it's still dark. Close this Blender render window. However, we need to make a few additional adjustments. Click over here on Color Management 
and over here make sure that standard is selected. Okay, now we are ready to generate the white background. To do that, click over here on compositing and over here click on use notes. Then over here click on add and under this menu color select alpha over. Click over here, move this window a little bit and I will zoom this part such you, that you can see what's happening over here and move this window such that this yellow dot crosses the line and you can see that you attach this window between this window and this window. Now we need to make a few adjustments so click over here and move this line to here and over here modify this to 1. Okay, let's see now the output. Again, click on render, click on render image and wait for a while and let's see the output. And here it is. Now the background is completely white. Next, let us save this image and let's try to open this image from another software. To do that, click over here on image and click on save as. And over here you need to select the folder. Here I will save the file in my temporary folder and I will call the image as image. One, for example. And save as. Okay. Here is my temporary folder and here is my image. Let's try to open this image, do the right click and I will be using earphone view. And voila, here it is. You can see that the background is completely white. Then later on you can of course crop this image, you can decrease the background and you can save it and include it in your project report or in your paper. Okay, that would be all for today. I hope that you like this video. If you like the videos I'm creating, please press the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks a lot and have a nice day.